This is my uh, Maxwell Hemmons uh, Birmingham Dribbler um, and after uh, a repair and modification of the cylinders it now runs quite happily at least on air so we will now try it on steam and see how it goes. Not exactly the best of burner designs, very easy to burn your fingers, putting it in the, in the frame. It's a bit more smoky than I would normally expect from uh, Amad side fuel tablets, but I suspect that's probably oil burning. remember which is which way is on which is off the whistle but, uh, I think that's off Well, I guess it's four o'clock and I've got the windows open. It's actually quite a nice sunny warm day. Most unlike English summer. Safety valve needs to be tightened up a bit. That's better. Need 
Here you there. It's a bit more pressure, I think. Not performing brilliantly well, is it? See the tablets are not working, not, not burning very well. Unfortunately, the burner design is not really suitable for anything other than solid fuel tablets at the moment. I may uh, modify it to work with either Meths or Sterno, if I can do that without uh, permanently damaging it. At least it's sort of going. Performance could be better. I think the problem is with the burner rather than the cylinders now. Seems to run okay if the pressure is allowed to build up a bit. although it's still not a uh, very high speed. I don't know how fast these are normally expected to run. But I can see that those Mammoth tablets, tablets are not burning very well at all.
that's it just gone out oh well sort of partial success a little bit disappointing but at least the uh, the repairs and the modifications to the cylinders are working I just need to look at the uh, the burner now big thanks to uh, Kevin on the uh, on the forum who uh, did the uh, repairs and the modifications I only had to do a, a minor tweak afterwards Well, I'm trying this burner with um, with some sterno instead of the tablets. Now, I haven't actually modified the burner at all, so I'm not quite sure it'll, if it'll work at all. Because the tablets normally sit on top of a mesh. Not sure if the gel will sink down below the mesh or not. It seems to be burning reasonably well at the moment. That doesn't seem to be going much better than with the tablets. And it looks like the meth, the uh, sterno is almost burnt out before it's even got to pressure. So maybe I might have to take the mesh out of the burner. Sterno is virtually all gone now. So it looks as if, at the very least, the burner will have to be modified if only by taking the grid out, the mesh out. Okay, I've taken the mesh out of the burner so it can now hold more sterno than it did. We'll see if it's any any better. Now at least there's plenty of still plenty of sterno left. Still not uh, burning brilliantly well. I think it needs some more air. tray itself seems to be covering up half of the air holes on the, in the sides which is not very good anyway certainly not going to it doesn't do any good performance seems to be very little different whether it's running on tablets or sterno with or without the mesh I think I may have to improve the air supply a bit. 
seems to work all right for a few seconds after I've let the uh, pressure build up. It's just that the burner isn't isn't uh, hot enough to maintain steam supply. No, it's not going to get any better, is it? Oh well. But at least it's uh, it's not an original Victorian Birmingham tripler. It's only a 1970s or 1980s one, so I won't feel too guilty about making minor modifications to the burner. give that a try. Okay, I've uh, modified the burner, drilled a few extra air holes in, but most important I've actually modified it for meths by putting some rock wool underneath the, um, the mesh so that it's now a, a vaporising meths burner. I've also added a wooden handle onto it because it gets pretty hot. <laughs> so we'll see how it goes now. Okay the meths burner is uh, Burning quite well. Just added some more oil into the cylinders just need to wait for it to get back up to boil now. Still not brilliant Sometimes self-starting, which is a good sign, but uh, still doesn't seem to be able to keep up the pressure. Yeah, it seems to be picking up. too soon. It seems to be blowing past the cylinder on this side. Not on this side. So maybe the piston packing needs to be redone on that side. It seems to be doing a bit better than it was yesterday. I think that's the end of the mess.